for some reason. Maybe I'm shorter. Whew. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be carving a pumpkin from the garden. I can't understand myself. And I gave myself an accent, so. Ah, sloppy. Hi everyone! That's better. I never did good with fake teeth. Today, I'm going to be carving the last pumpkin in my pumpkin series. This will make number 10. This is another pumpkin from my garden. He's my biggest pumpkin I've ever grown. He's a little under 17 pounds, and his name is Titan. So, I'm really excited to cut him up. I'm not going to be doing anything spectacular with this one. It's just going to be a, a basic scary pumpkin face, because, uh, I've carved quite a few and my arms are really tired. So I hope you'll forgive me, it's not that complicated. Maybe next year we'll do something really special. This one actually grew in the part of my garden I call the jungle. That's basically an area of my garden where if I have any leftover seeds or seeds I don't know um, what they are, I'll just kind of toss them in there and let them go. And I thought they were squash seeds, but it turns out it was a pumpkin seed. So this bad boy popped up and he grew through the chicken wire in the fence. So I had to put a bucket under him so he wouldn't uh, break off his stem as he got bigger. And so here he is. So he doesn't have like the damage that other pumpkins have from laying on the ground. This is from where he was touching like the chain, the chicken wire. So he's got a couple of scratches there, but other than that, he's pretty much an untouched pumpkin. How beautiful. It's such a beautiful boy. All right, now I've introduced you to our victim. I mean our pumpkin. Let's get started. Gonna need a washable marker, Gooby Doopy tools, a knife, oh, something to put your seeds in, a bowl to put everything in, and a pumpkin. This side's gonna be my front right here. So I'm gonna be carving the top of my pumpkin in a star shape, which was what I used to do when I was little. Once again, the harvest pumpkin seeds from your pumpkin. See how they grow in clumps and clusters? Just kind of like slide that between your fingers and gently pull and you got a handful of seeds. Pretty clean, just like that. I roasted a lot of pumpkin seeds this year, but most of the pumpkin seeds I saved are going to be used for the birds. Get your hands in there. Hollow out your pumpkin. I try to hollow out the face side of my pumpkin to make it as thin as possible for carving. Take your marker and doodle on your design. I'm using wide round eyes separated for a creepy creepy look. I want it to look like the mouth is ripping itself open to eat you. So I drew these lazy diamond patterns to help achieve that, that ripping, tearing, stretching look. I started with a little paring knife, then after a while I got frustrated, decided to go through my junk and actually find my pumpkin carving tools. After doing my initial large cutouts, I went in with the smaller knife and the cutting tool and made some more little holes 
in between them. Not in every single one, just in every other one so it would look more natural and organic. I had to adjust that eyeball around and pop it out. Carve out the back to make it look bigger, and you're done! I could have definitely stretched out the the little bits to make it look a more wider, but ah, you live and learn. I'm so happy how he turned out. <gasps> Look at him, he is so cute. I think if I had a little bit more practice with like the pulling of the flesh idea, I could get it like really spoopy looking, but I know for my first try, I think I did okay. My hand really hurts. Well, I think that does it for this year's Haunted Halloween Pumpkin Carving Special. Thank you for following me if you watched all the videos, all eight of you. I had a great time this year and hopefully next year I can do something just as fun. When did that happen? Um, fun. Ah, uh, I think I might have cut myself on something. Um, and I think that's gonna be it for this year. Uh, I'm gonna go get a band-aid. Um, why is it getting worse? Um, um, so, uh, I think, I think we're done carving pumpkins for the year. Um, uh, uh, you guys, you guys be safe out there, okay? Don't 